Today, Sunny and I are reacting to episode 100 of the Skippy Wars. In this episode, the Tri-Titan is fighting the Triadians. And the Necromancer betrayed the Toilet Emperor. Oh my goodness, this episode is absolutely insane. You've got to stick around to see it all. Melon, it's finally here. Episode 100 of Veer Lance's Skibbity Wars. No way. It's going to go crazy. If you remember last time, what happened is the TV woman or the tri woman she just became friends with the tri titan i'm pretty sure that purple big guy all he wanted was some friends a pal in this world yeah and then she pretty much saved him and now we're gonna see an epic war versus the rest of the tridians bro i honestly think the tri titan's about to get so angry and destroy everyone now let's go episode 100 this battle's gonna be insane bro what is happening right now Looks like two of the titans are retreating because these guys have determined- What did they just say? That the necromancer's tracking device is online again. Oh. What the heck, bro? Who do you think the necromancer is? I don't know, but he can't be a good guy. Not with a name like necromancer. But what if the necromancer's just that TV woman who saved the Tri-Titan here? I don't think so. Or maybe the Tri-Titan is the necromancer. That's why they want him. I'm not sure, Sonny, but I do know the Tri-Titan's getting teamed up on right now. It's okay. He should be able to handle these Tridians. He's stronger. Oh my goodness. I didn't realize how much bigger he was, too. Yeah, dude, this guy's huge, and he's got that epic sword. Let's go. This is like watching kaijus fight, bro. These dudes are humongous. Yeah, but I think he just made one Tridian really mad. Yeah, you're right about that. Oh, Melon, that guy just powered up a lot. Oh, it don't matter, though, Sonny. Bruh. The Titans are just sitting by watching. Yeah, they're not interfering. I also wonder what's stronger, the Tridians or the Titans? I feel like it's pretty close. But it looks like the Alliance is all about to get in the mix here. It bears remarkable resemblance to the Toilet Emperor. The Toilet Emperor? It's probably a coincidence. Either way, whatever that thing did, it resulted in the Tri-Titan turning on its own species. Mm. No way. Melon, you don't think that the TV woman is actually the toilet overlord now? No, there's no way. That would be insane. Hmm. But something weird is happening behind the scenes. Yeah, I'm curious what those other guys behind the Tridians are up to. They're trying to find this Necromancer, and when they do, things are not gonna be the same. But for now, let's see who wins. Come on, try Titan, pop off, King. He's turning against his own species, Sonny. Yeah, but he knows it's for the right cause, because he's got to protect his TV woman. He loves her. Where did they just jump off to? I don't know. They're going interstellar! That is crazy, Sonny. This is the most insane skibbity fight I've ever seen. Yeah, bro, this is like anime right now. This is nuts. Who do you think's gonna win this? Hold on. Pause! Oh, that was a perfect moment. Bro, 100% the Tri-Titan. I got faith in my boy. I got a feeling it's gonna be a tie game where they're both gonna retreat injured, and then those other people are gonna show up and be like, Sire, here's the Necromancer. We must capture him now while he's weakened. Oh, you're right. I have a feeling something like that's gonna happen too. Let's find out. It's safe to say that the Tri-Titan and the remaining Triadian distracted for now who knows what will happen once their conflict blows over mm. it's hard to say but whatever is going to happen we're going to have to gather everyone i'm assuming the cameras and speakers are all on the way back to the 
Sonny, I gotta say, this series is insane, bro. It's so well animated. Yeah, I needed to pause it there just to reflect. So what's happening right now is that orange or red Triadian is battling with the Tri-Titan, who's the purple giant. But all the other Alliance members are not even related to that fight. They're using it as a distraction to gather their forces. Oh. To do what, though? I think to perhaps destroy the Toilet Emperor. Oh. <laughs> Oh, that's a good idea. Toilet Emperor is more than likely planning the same thing. It's been a while since we have seen or heard anything from his underworld followers. He'll probably return alongside the Necromancer and the Phantom. Oh no. We'll have to be prepared for everything. They're trying to stop an uprising right now, Sonny. Yeah, this is gonna be brutal. They found it, the Necromancer. Oh, they're saying he committed treason. Oh, that makes sense. The Necromancer is the toxic toilet. Sorry, sorry about that, everybody. Goats, forgive us. We weren't sure if the TV woman, after she converted the Tri-Titan into her own ally, if that meant Necromancer, but I guess it's just this toxic toilet. Bro, the Necromancer is creepy. Yeah, no cap. And he's got a horde of undead toilets. You must bow down to the Emperor Toilet or perish. Uh, I feel like some civil war is about to happen. Yeah, this is nuts. All the Emperor had to do was say, please. Yo! Oh, they're gonna fight! This guy does not care. He's got no fear. I like the Necromancer. I have a feeling the Necromancer is about to kill him. Yeah, he's got a trick up his sleeve. Why is he laughing like that? No, something's not right, dude. Wait, what? He just killed the Necromancer. I don't think so. I feel like the Necromancer knew this would happen. Uh... Yo. What is going on? They're making fun of him. No, I think they're about to take over the Emperor, and it's gonna be an army of the undead. I think you're right, Sonny. The Necromancer had this planned all along. He's still laughing! Oh, I don't think that was his real body, Sonny. Something crazy is about to happen. No more running. Yo, undead G-Man. Look at his weapons. Bro, he looks insane. Okay, Melon, we're almost at the end of this episode 100, but it was all just a buildup for what's gonna happen next. This is insane. Dude, I cannot wait for episode 101 or 100 part two. It's about to go crazy. Bro, I have a feeling this is shaping up to be the best episode of Skibbity ever out of all the multiverses. Same here, and I'm all for it. Big shout out to Virulence for one of the greatest series in the Skibbity universe. Check out his channel and drop a like on this video if you want to see part two. Goats, the Skibbity Wars is actually insane. And today we're going to be learning about the secret of of the triads and how the computer people betrayed the TV woman. No way, Melon. Fearless just uploaded the Skibbity Wars 99. Bro, finally they're out. I can't wait to see what happens. This is gonna be the craziest battle we've ever seen in the Skibbity universe. Oh, the cold open with the Cinema Man versus the Counter Ultimate Titan. Bro, that Titan looks absolutely insane. Bro, I've got a bad feeling for the Cinema Man. Yeah, these look like alien Titans. They are nuts. Uh... Wait. Is he beating them? What's going on? I think he's brainwashing them. 
The Titan Computer Man's here too. Yo, they've hacked these Titans. No way. Yo. This alternate series is crazy. It might be the best one. Bro. Wait, what the heck? That guy just wrecked him. Are you sure? Let's see. Boom! Oh my goodness, he blasted him. It just looked like a counterattack, though. It's like they're corrupting them easily. They gotta hold them off, though, so the computer man can hack it. That's true. But this fight seems way too casual. No one even seems upset. Oh, it's so weird. It's like they're just corrupting them. Whoa. Flashback nine months ago. We're at the Alliance headquarters. Okay, experimental facility. They're going deeper, dude. They're going to the lower levels. Whoa. Whoa. It looks like an ancient titan. Yeah, bro, that's an ancient titan from another alien species. They're trying to attach speakers to it. I think they're trying to control it. Hmm. Do you think it's a kaiju titan? Whoa! It might be, Sonny. They're hacking into it right now. That is so insane. TV woman seems scared, though. She seems upset, like what they're doing is morally wrong. Did she shut it down? I think she did. Uh-oh, they are not happy with her. An exclusive offer. Yeah, they are upset. Uh oh. Wait, that was a tri titan that they were looking at there? That's insane. She's about to get bus and upgrades. Uh, I don't know, Sunny. I don't know if this is going to be too good for her. Whoa. Wait, they put her soul into the Tri Titan. Something like that? Is it soul bound now? She is powerful, bro. Oh, no. They messed up big time. Whoa. She's been corrupted by the Tri-Titan, and she's gonna turn them all into this new species. She just might, Sonny. Or she's just trying to set him free. Yeah, but remember, this is nine months ago. In the future, there's many of them with this purple aura. Oh, you're right, bro. She's the original Corruptor! Bro, this is cool. What if they're the good guys, though? I guess this is showing the origin story of it. They're not so bad after all. Aw, she's so proud of him. She's like, this is my good little boy. It's like a puppy, except big and violent and has crazy weapons and can kill everyone. Oh no, they killed her, which is why he's so mad. That's why he's seeking revenge. True, bro. The computer should never have messed with them. Interesting. It seems her modifications gave her a form of bond with the Triadian. Oh, it's a Triadian, Sonny, not a Tri-Titan. No. Yeah, Triadian, Tri-Titan, all the same. They want to be in full control. Hmm. Very well. Are they even strong enough to stop this Triadian? Nothing personal. We're just following orders. I don't know, but it seems like they can control it somehow. Forgive me. Memory reset. Wiping her core. No way. But she just got all her memories back. And her purple powers. 
Let's go. What did you do? Uh oh. Everything. What did I not do? He was stabilizing the Triadian, but she's not gonna let him. 97% and it had to error out. That is unlucky. Uh oh. Not anymore. She's not happy. What are they gonna do? <laughs> that was so cute. Mama. That's what this big guy is saying. This cannot be true. What is happening, Sonny? What is going on? Bro, are they opening a world to another universe? I think they're gonna try and take on the evil Triadian. Bruh. Oh no. It's their only hope. He ate her. No! Not cool. You just made him really mad. How many of them are there? Probably three. Pink, purple, and red. Who's the strongest Triadian? Definitely the purple guy, and he's about to unleash his wrath. Bro, the next episode in this battle is gonna be nuts. Whoa, who is this guy? I think that the TV woman is the secret necromancer who can control the Triadians. This is absolutely insane. Goats, if you're interested in this series and want us to keep following along, make sure you comment down below. Also, subscribe to our channel. And if you want to see the original, check out Virulence, linked in the video details. Today, Sunny and I are going to be reacting to the Skibbity Zombieverse. In this episode, we're trying to create the ultimate alliance against the zombie virus, because that is the real threat. Melon, this is Monster Ups, episode 18 of the Skibbity Zombie Toilet Universe. No way. What is that thing, Sonny? It's obviously an evil demigorgon. What the heck? Oh, no. How are we going to take that thing out? Bro, I don't know. And look at it. It's technically a corrupted TV man. If we take a deeper look and analyze it, even the TVs have a demogorgon mouth. Oh, my goodness. This needs to be put to a stop. Bro, it's only the first two seconds of episode 18, and I'm already freaking out. Whoa. Who's this guy? I have no idea, but I have a feeling he's about to whoop some demigorgon. Bro, or he's gonna get wrecked. Never mind, he's quick. Yo! Yo, chill! Who is this dude? He's like some fire wielder. Yeah, I don't get it. Is this like a shout out to Avatar The Last Airbender and the Fire Nation is struck? Because he doesn't have a camera or a speaker or a TV. He just has a crazy battle axe that explodes on impact. I don't know, Sonny. We're about to find out more about him, though. People of Genesis, your enemy is not the Alliance, but the virus. You have to unite together for a common victory. Whoa, he can talk. And he's trying to convince all the toilets to work together with the Alliance. Yeah, they're trying to unite everyone against the virus. That's actually really smart. Speakers will survive this war. Yo, this guy's got a dip. He's creating a portal and he's out of here. Yeah, the speakers did not like that. Which is weird, because they're part of the Alliance. Yeah, but I don't think they want to team up, Sonny. True. We're going to figure out if there's any new Titans now, though. Yo, put on the super upgraded armor. Exoskeleton acquired. No way. Also, Melon, take a look at these screens. This is some shoutouts to other YouTubers who've done reaction videos. If we're lucky, we might make it into one of these episodes. That would be really cool. Hopefully one day. Yo, what? Why is the speaker man so evil? Because, Sonny, they have too much beef. They don't want the Alliance to win. 
Whatever, bro. We got this. We gotta help out that crazy Fire Nation dude. Bro, he's actually busted. He might be stronger than the Titans. Yeah, and come to think of it, did you see his ability there? It looked a lot like the Titan Clockman's. Yeah, it really did. No way. He can't be a clock under there. What if he's the Time Lord? That would be really cool. I think he is, bro. What is he doing? He's just the goat. <laughs> no way. He just cut a rift into multi dimensions. Bro, I think he's the Space Lord. He can control dimensions like they're nothing. Look, the Multiverse Titan Clockman. Oh my goodness, he's a dimension hopper. This is crazy. We can see all the other Skibbity Multiverse episodes and people's react videos. Bruh. Do you think we just learned the secrets of the time continuum? I think we might have. I feel like Doctor Strange right now. We know every possible ending. Whoa, Titan Drill Man out of nowhere! But this guy looks corrupted, Sonny. He's a zombie! Ew, you're right. That is gross. It's okay, though. We've united forces, and we shall defeat it. <gasps> the Skibbities. They're actually coming in clutch. Come on, Astro Toilet, destroy that zombie drill. But Melon, we'll have to wait until episode 19 to see what happens. So for now, everybody should subscribe! And stick around until the end of this video to see so many more epic Skibbity Multiverses. We're gonna react to the newest episode of the Multiverse Skibbity series by Dom Studios. This is episode 29. Then, let's go on a movie throughout the world of the Skibbies. Comment which episode and moment is your favorite. Personally, I love the moment where the Titan Cinema Man first appeared. It's time! We're gonna check out episode 29 of the Skibbity Multiverse, bro. Dom Studios drops that heat. I can't wait to see it and see what kind of new units are out. Yo, true, bro. Started off with a little drone so they could spy on the toilets, but I wonder what cameraman's up to. Uh, that guy's cursed. That guy's cursed. He only has one eye and he's being super creepy. That sound effect gives me a bad feeling. Uh oh. It's okay though. We got that laser cameraman railgun. Uh, Melon, I feel like this is a trap. Nah, it's fine. It's fine. I don't know. Those toilets look corrupted. Uh. Okay, we're all dead. Is that... It's the Super Scientist Titan Toilet! Bro, he's even got magnets. He's got magnets, he's got lasers, he's giant-sized. Something is cooked with this guy. Oh my goodness, but he's getting wrecked because our Titans have appeared. Have they, though? Oh yeah, they did. I believe. Dude, check him out. He's so strong now. Yeah, he's crazy. He's got the mini guns and he's got a giant laser cannon. Oh, it's over. I think this is where the scientist dies. Yo, he used a gravity gun. This is gonna be fire. I hope it's finally over for the scientist. I'm so sick of him and his nasty, toxic weapons. Oh! Bro, this is actually such an epic fight. Wait, what? He just stole his hammer. Melon, this is bad. Oh no, boomerang style! Ooh! Bro, that scared me. Wait, no way! Titan Cinema Man came in just in the clutch to grab the hammer. Dude, it's over for the scientist. What? Bro, the multiverse? The multiverse is insane. I'm so confused. You've become pretty bold, haven't you? What? That drill Titan is hopeless. As long as he keeps holding back, 
he's of no use. Dude. Well, I guess it's better than having him against us. She's from another universe. She seems evil, kind of. Took me long enough to prepare my master's favorite toy. Oh my goodness. Behold, the counter titan. No way! Oh no. Oh no. This is not good for <laughs> the cameraman, Sonny. She is so evil. What is that? It's the counter titan. <laughs> I think the toilets don't even like her. Wait, what? The scientist did that? Yeah, I think she's a third party, bro. No one likes her. He's like, I'm supposed to be in charge around here. It's the toilets versus the cameras, not you. Maybe. But maybe the counter titan's just too strong. No, Melon, did you hear what she just said? She just said whatever. We planned to eliminate all of the species. She's trying to take over the planet and kill everything. No way, what the heck? We were planning to eliminate all the species anyway. She's so evil! Bruh. Things are gonna get really cool in the multiverse. I got a feeling the toilets are gonna team up with the Alliance. So there's gonna be drill men, the doodles, the cameras, the speakers, everyone working together on the same side. All against her, the anti-Titan. Well, we're gonna have to wait for episode 30. So in the meantime, you goats should totally subscribe to our channel, press that like button, and stick around for the rest of this epic movie. Do it! Melon, we're immediately going into part two of episode episode 29. Oh, I can't wait to see what happens. Hopefully the counter titan doesn't do too much damage. I hope that the titan TV man and titan cameraman can team up with G-Man. They need to work together to stop the counter titan. No. Sonny, he's too strong. He's actually too strong. Bro. The Titan cameraman jumped in the way of the attack. He was trying to stop TV man from dying. Look. Whoa, bro, that is actually a hero move. Look at that, Cinema Man just blasted with all his strength. Dude, and it did absolutely nothing. The sword, maybe the sword can break its armor. Bro, how are they gonna stop the counter titan? I don't know if they can, bro, they need help. What? Whoa, 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 hold up. Melon, did you see what just happened? The counter titan scanned them and then stole their weapon abilities. Oh my goodness, dude, he's just too powerful. He has copying abilities now. We need the titan clock man to come help, but what if it copied the clock man's time freeze? Oh, I don't know, Sonny, that's really risky. Come on, guys. They need the upgraded Titan Drill Man. That's the only way they're gonna win. I think they need the toilets to unite. I think that's the only way. Because these new villains want to destroy everything. You're right. But in the last episode, she said the upgraded Titan Drill Man was always holding back. No way. The Counter Titan has so many abilities. Bro, he's too powerful. He is too powerful. They need to keep the Titans away from him. They need to find a different way to battle it. But wait, they actually kind of cooked there. They kind of cooked. They got one of his limbs off. Oh, never mind. This doesn't look good, though, for the cinema man. Wait, he just got another limb. Never mind, the cinema man is crushing. Oh, wait, it just regrew its limb instantly, Sonny. Bro, that's overpowered. It can regenerate. But it just got stabbed in the heart. Uh-oh. It doesn't even seem bothered. It just took over one of the TVs. Nah, bro, that's too far. Oh, no. 
Dude, did we just watch the upgraded Titan Cinema Man die? I hope not, bro. They cut it short. It faded to black. I hope that means someone's gonna show up and surprise us. Please save him. Clock Man. How strong is that counter Titan? It can fight two on one like it's nothing. We need more help. Bro, they need the Clock Man and I'm telling you, they need the giant toilet's help. It's the only way. Goats, make sure you subscribe because part three is gonna come out soon and we'll definitely react to it. This is the Skibbity Multiverse episode 28 by Dom Studios. We're reacting to the ultimate battle between the toilets and the alliance. Only this time, new characters appear who have mysterious motives. Will the drill men be able to rescue their friends? Or is destroying the toilet headquarters the only priority that matters to these new characters? Let's find out. Melon, it's finally here. Episode 28 of the Skibbity Toilet Multiverse. Bro, I wonder what's gonna happen. Big shout outs to Dom Studios. Oh, Sonny, it looks like the Skibbities are wrecking the camera, people. Yeah, it's been overrun out here, that's for sure. But remember, in the multiverse, anything can happen. Just like that, dude, he just hit a trick shot. Yeah, and then a truck's busted through with TV Woman. They gotta get reinforcements and back out of here. I feel like the TV people never take L's. Yeah, and bro, did you see that? That toilet was mega glitched. Look at this. Whoa! Bro, he's absolutely cursed! Yeah, that was the weirdest, craziest glitch toilet I've ever seen. And it's back for more! Except we got the clock, people! Thank goodness they're here to freeze time. That could have been real bad. And they just stabbed him in the cheek. Yeah, bro, that guy's cursed, though. He's gotta go. They should probably flush him to be safe. Agreed. Activate the plunge and send him back to the sewers. Wait. Oh, I thought they hit the clock people, but they just hit the guy. Yeah, they got rid of that toilet. Whoa, 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 whoa. Melon, melon. Skibbity base zero. This might be the original headquarters. Oh my goodness. I didn't realize we were invading Skibbity base. Let's go. Uh oh, that's a hacker toilet. Yeah, and he's sneaking through right now. He might steal their weapons. Uh. Except he just invaded a place where many other hacker toilets had failed. Look, it's a digital camera. Yeah, it was all a trap. They've captured him. Bang! The hacking squad is done. Imagine that too. You think you're being sneaky, but it was really all part of their plan. Bro, we're actually wrecking the Skibbities this episode. Yep. I think this is the time for the Alliance to finally win. Yo, this guy is so cool. Yeah, that's the assassin drill. I'm wondering what happened to the president clock man, because he was up to no good. Yeah, dude. He might have started the entire skibbity problem. I'm pretty sure he did. And what's up with this camera guy? Why has he got a Rubik's Cube? I don't know, just for fun. Now that guy can play with it. Yeah, it makes sense, I guess. Yo, 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 what? Is that a magnet toilet or a mini astro toilet? What is that? I don't know, Sonny. I think it's a new kind of toilet. And it's smashed. Whoa, pencil guy. Since when are there pencils? Dude, this is awesome, bro. I bet you he can draw anything. He drew that hammer in. No way. They're about to erase the skibbities. <laughs> yeah, literally, bro. Pens and pencils out of nowhere? I didn't know these existed. Check it out! He can draw anything! That was so cool. I actually kind of feel bad for the toilets, I'm not gonna cap. Dude, how are the skibbities ever gonna win? We're just too powerful. Yeah... He just killed his own people, though. What the heck? Wait, what? What just happened? I'm so confused. They're redrawing themselves, but why would he stab them in the first place? Oh, I guess it was an accident. He's like, my bad, bruh. <laughs> that was weird. He's a little clumsy. Yep, that's for sure. 
I wonder when they're gonna add the Titan Pencil Man. Oh my goodness. Well, more importantly, I wonder what the Skibbities are gonna do after this. What is that? What is that? Uh, Melon? They just released the ultimate Skibbity Toilet! That thing is cursed! Bro, they need to eliminate that right now! It's the host! The Big Brain Toilet! Who are these guys? What was that Titan? Yeah, but he's dead, Melon. What is that? It says, this is not their Titan. Whose Titan is this then? I don't think it is a Titan. It's just a robot from the future from Penn Corporations. Oh no, Melon. I think I know what's going on. What's happening, Sonny? Do you notice how the drawn-in units are mostly white like paper? Yeah? You know who else was in a white suit? The President Clock Man. I have a feeling he's creating his own army to conquer the world. You think so, Sonny? This is not good. Thank you. I think they're trying to trick everyone to team up with them. Oh, so then they can rule all of the Earth. That's it. When they least expect it, they're gonna switch squads and unleash all kinds of havoc. As it was predicted, GMAP Apocalypse is in their main head corner. One last base. Skibidi Toilet Base Number One. Located. Bro, they've eliminated all of their bases except one. And it's the last location where the G-Man is held. However, we must focus on our main goal. G-Man Apocalypse Project cannot be allowed to succeed. This is so weird. Is not rescue. Did he just say their mission is not rescue? What did he say? Not rescue. Our mission is not rescue. That's what he said. He doesn't even care about these guys. He just wants to destroy G-Man. Yeah, but who do they even have captive? We respect your decision. Be safe, and if anything happens, we hope this can help. Whoa. It's a pen? Not just any pen, Melon. I bet it's a pen of mass destruction. Or it's a communication device in case they need backup. That is awesome. But Melon, what do you think's gonna happen? Will the Alliance be able to save their friends? Or will that giant AI Titan destroy that Skibbity base first? He's not a Titan, Sonny, but I think they're gonna have to rescue that person, but that's gonna let G-Man escape. Oh, that's not good. I can't wait to find out though. So make sure you goats are subscribed because next time in episode 29, we'll learn what happens with the G-Man. Today, Sonny and I react to the newest Skibbity Toilet episode. Guys, you're not gonna believe what happened. It's absolutely crazy! Melon, I got all of the latest episodes of the Skibbity series. Are you ready for this? Oh my days. Sonny, I'm so excited! Let's go! Dude, do you remember what happened at episode 50? They were at the camera headquarters and there was an invasion! Oh no. Oh no! But then if I remember right... Remember what, huh? You think the Titan's gonna save them? I'm pretty sure a Titan comes in. Clutch! We'll see, Melon. Yo, the Yo. toilet tank. Wait, Sonny, pause. Rewind, rewind. Yeah, yeah, pause. Yo, check it out. That one cameraman right there is going in double plunger. <laughs> Dude, who is he? Yo, he's such a legend. He's all by himself. And Titan. Titan cameraman. Say goodbye to your toilets. You've been flushed. Bro, he's upgraded. Uh oh. Flame toilet. <laughs> A roasted. Yeah. I would not mess with this boy. That was crazy. He's not done yet, Melon. Yo, look at these guys. Just thumbs up. Thanks, boss. Appreciate you. 
Bro, what's gonna happen next? Yo, Titan TV first person POV. I haven't seen this yet. Whoa, dude, this is crazy. He's actually wrecking them. And I meant to say Titan cameraman. Whoa! That poor Skibby never stood a chance. Dude, this is actually the coolest one I think I've ever seen. Whoa, imagine being a Titan, you're so strong. I wish they always showed the combat like this. It's so much cooler in first person. What? He's gonna flush him after burning him. That was brutal. The double plunger man. Yeah, you're right. It's the same guy from before. What if he's actually the leader of all the cameramen? That would be crazy. What if he's even stronger than the Titan himself? You're right, bro. He just might be. He's gonna need to help them out, though. Here he is! Double Plunger Man! Whoa. I think he's the main character, to be honest. Oh, oh. Wait, what the? Wait, Sonny, rewind, rewind. What happened? I'm rewinding. Since when did they get camera ships to drop off cameramen? You're right. I've never seen that before. That's cool. They're getting all kinds of new technology and weapons. They have to. The toilets are getting stronger as well. Get that out of here. Ooh, is that a camera lady? He's got no time to riz, Melon. He's got to focus up. Uh-oh. What? <laughs> what the heck? She's nuts. Sonny, we got to get an instant replay. Okay, okay, okay. Yo. <laughs> Thumbs up. Bro, what's going to happen in 53 now? Yeah, the toilets need to retreat. Get out of this city. Mr. Double Plunge here, reporting for combat. What the? That guy just appeared out of Whoa, nowhere. Yeah, I gotta rewind. I'm sorry, that was crazy. Look at this, Melon. He's not there. There's nothing here at all. There's nothing even flying in. He just appears! Bro, they've invented teleportation? Yo. And he's so fast! What? Dude, if they can use that on a Titan skibbity toilet, it's not gonna be good. Bro, the scientists working at the toilet headquarters are getting too smart. But so are the cameramen, Sonny. True. The war wages on, bruh. My guy is taking a little break sitting on that toilet. <laughs> Zapped him. Wait, what? <laughs> what no the way! Heck? What was that? He's like, oh, look at this new guy. Slapped him across the face. Yo, this is just sad now. These toilets are too weak. Oh, what did you say? <gasps> Wait, Sonny, pause. Okay, okay, sorry. I spoke way too soon. Remember, this is the electric toilet that wrecked the cameramen's in one of the beginning episodes. I thought he just disappeared. You're right. He's back. Look how fast it is. TV woman. Oh! Wait, is she okay? Oh, I thought we were going to see a TV man get defeated for the first time. Nope, not even close. All part of the plan. Calculated victory. Aww. <laughs> oh, he wanted a hug. He wanted to say thank you, and he got denied! Take that, sucker! She said, no rizzing here. Just collect the toilets. All them toilets. Hey, they're trying to take back the city from the desert episode. Oh, that looks easy. I'll be real, Sonny. The toilets are getting wrecked. Bro, that's why they brought in the triple toilet. That looked like a toaster. You ever seen those urinals, bro? It's like a five-man urinal. It's crazy. I actually think that one was a bathtub. I'm not even capping. You might be right, Sonny. Wait. 
No, not the teleporting toilet. That one is too fast, even for the Titan. Wait, what is that? Gross! It just spat diarrhea out. All right, good. Get rid of that skull. Gross. I don't think the camera people are okay, though. It took a lot of damage. Dude, I was worried for the Titan TV there. Yo, they're getting revenge at least. Yes, take them out, TV peeps. Whoa, I wonder what that TV said. Dude, should we play it in reverse? Maybe. Yo, Melon, that was nuts. It's so weird listening to them backwards. I know. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait, what? Play that back. What just happened? Bro, he doesn't want to what? I don't understand. Oh, he doesn't want the smoke, Sonny. Oh no, there's gonna be a really strong toilet. Even worse, the corrupted speaker man. No. Oh no. Oh no. Dude, they need to cure his virus already. Yeah, it's not good. What the heck? Here's episode 57. This one is super special. It's extra long. Really? Yeah, it's a double feature. Because they gotta stop the Titan speaker, man. Bro, if they can actually reclaim him, that'll be an epic dub for all of cameramen. Yeah, pretty much. That's why they got the Titan here to say, listen up, bud, chill out, relax. He ain't chillin'. He ain't chillin'. Boom! Oh. Titans finally going at it! We've been waiting so long for this brawl. Yo, he dropped the base. Oh no! It's G-Man! Bro, we need a double team. We need a Titan TV to help. Yes. The plunger, man! It's the double plunger! He's gonna save him. Oh. Oh, oh no. Oh. oh Unlucky. No. <laughs> oh no. I guess he wasn't the main character. <laughs> yes! Wait, did G-Man just die? No! I think he's gonna be okay though. <laughs> just pancaked him. No, 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 no. Oh, dude, this is getting scary. Yeah, I thought they were gonna corrupt another Titan. Yes, oh. TV woman. Did she do it? G-Man, no! G-Man's angry. G-Man's freaking out. Oh, he's scared. He knows he's done. Did they save him? Yo, she's saving Double Plunger Man. So much carnage. So much destruction and ruin. It's sad. No. Oh, the cameraman. But at least we've reclaimed Speaker Head! Yo, he's Titan. so beautiful. But it's still sad, Melon. There were a lot of casualties in the toilet world. Yeah. Speaker Man, Titan. Thumbs up. Thumbs up for lots of dead cameras, but mostly dead toilets. I'm happy he's back. But how is he gonna live with himself after all the damage he's caused? We'll have to see here. In episode 58, he's gotta get his vengeance. Come on, destroy that. Oh no, that is a lot of dead camera people. Melon, he's back with vengeance in his mind. He's got a heart of rage. He's gotta make up for what happened to him. Come on, save the cameramen. Be the hero they deserve. Yep, I'd say he's doing a pretty good job at making it right. Oh, 
Oh no. Maybe that was too much. Not even close. He dusted them! Yo, he's so strong. The two titans can finally work together. He's like, yo, what? My job's already done? It was that easy? Thumbs up. And you should totally give this video a thumbs up. Press that like button right now. And make sure you're subscribed to our channel so you never miss out on any of the fun. Let's go! Today, Sunny and I are gonna be reacting to episode 71, part one of Skibbity. Goats, things don't go too well for the cameraman in this episode. Comment down below, save the cameraman to help them out. Melon, it's finally time for us to check out episode 71. Bro, I can't wait. I already know this is gonna be epic. Bro, I want to see what happens after the last episode ended. Come on. Whoa. Wait, bruh. Sonny, is that the upgraded Titan TV man? I guess not. Nah, that's the godly cinema man with the other Titans. Oh, yes. Oh, no. They're going to fire nukes at them, though. Yeah, and they're gonna block it all out, bro, with one... Oh, no, it landed on the cameraman. Dang it, bro, I wanted to see what happened. Well, it's safe to say that cameraman is dead. Yeah, he is probably not around anymore. And that's not great. What's so bad, Sonny? Oh, never mind, they're chilling, they're chilling. I thought the rest of this was about to explode. Nah, but they took some heavy damage here. Yo, red laser cameraman, he's vibing. He's got the toilet paper on his hip. Bro, he's ready to wipe. Yeah, but this looks like bad news, bro. This must be toilet headquarters, and they're about to release Godzilla of toilets. Oh no, take him down, boys. Yo, that was nuts. Uh-oh. G-Man's here! I told you they were gonna release the beast! Bro, What the heck? He's hitting him with those laser beams. Uh, Sonny, they just annihilated the cameraman. Also, since when can toilets walk around like this? Oh my goodness, it's a new breed. They've learned to stand up straight. That's insane. It's got the saw blade whole arm. These are looking more and more like members of the cameraman squad. Except that they got corrupted by toilets. This is bad. Very bad. Where are the titans? They should have been there to help. Yeah, bro, like eight cameramen at least just died. And then there's the creepy astro toilet again. Yeah, I really do not like that guy. He always kills me on toilet tower defense. And he's so fast. Well, Melon, episode 71 is starting off on a cliffhanger. Part one of this is crazy. So many cameramen were defeated, and then the toilets escaped. I can't wait to see part two. Today, we're finally gonna react to the amazing Digital Circus first episode. This new show has taken over YouTube, and the characters are already some of our favorites. Who do you like best? Jax is such a troll. His jokes crack me up. The first 500 new viewers to subscribe to our channel will get goaded! So yeah, press that button right now. Melon, are you ready? We're gonna check out the amazing Digital Circus finally. Dude, I can't wait! I've always wondered what this was. Let's go. Glitch Productions. The amazing Digital Circus. By the way, guys, you can check the link in the video details to watch the video on their channel or even buy one of their t-shirts to support the Digital Circus! Dude, I love this guy. Yo, he's so goofy. Wait, Sonny. 
Yo, what? Dude, they just explained everyone's names. Did you remember that? Yeah, totally. Who's your favorite character so far? Kane. Because he's the only one I remembered, I'll be honest. Yeah, I think Jax and Ragatha and Bubbles and all of them are cool too. Whoa, they gave me a shout out, right? Right? <laughs> I guess so, Sonny. Yo, that's Pomni. Oh, bro, she tried to leave, but she couldn't. Yeah, the exit was closed. Oh, no. Uh oh. Kane, is this one of your NPCs or is this a new sucker? Because if it's a new character, we're gonna have to redo this whole theme song. I'm not doing that again. My, my! It appears a new human has entered this realm! Wait, Sonny, pause! Yeah, 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 chill, chill, chill. So Pomni's actually a human? And wait a second, they said NPC, so that makes me think this digital circus is within a video game. Yeah, I have a feeling somehow Pomni, she must have got sucked into this game. Keep grabbing at it. That works for all of us. What's going on? I put on some weird headset and now I'm here. Who are you people? Why can't I take it off? Where am I? Let's just try to calm down. Everything's gonna be okay, new stuff. We've all been through this. You Wait a second, Melon. All of the characters were once video gamers who got zucked into this game. Wait a second, I think you're right. Hold on a second, I want to hear everyone's stories. Just need to get your head. What the is going on? What? No, 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 my dear. We can't have any of that foul language around here. The amazing digital circus is a place to be enjoyed by all ages. You, my friend, stumbled into an incredible world of wonders where anything can happen. Shut up, Jax. <laughs> She's you. trapped. He's right. Welcome to your new home. And your new body. N a new home? Oof! Guys, don't be mean. We've been stuck here for years. Old well, Kinger over there's supposedly been here the longest. Oh, did someone say something about an insect collection? That's why he's crazy. <laughs> Wait, pause. Sonny, how long do you think King has been there for? I would guess at least 97 years. Bruh, that is a long, long time. Yeah, bro, he's been there even before the first video games. He got sucked into a real life circus. Oh, okay, now I get it. This is a dream, and I should just play along until I wake up, right? Uh... You say, mm. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's not a dream. Oof. So, Kane, we having a new adventure today for the newbie or what? I'd like to give our brand new member a tour of the circus grounds first. <laughs> Off we go! Yo, Kane is overpowered. Bro, this he is so fast. Are, as well as all sorts of other activities. These activities may include... Wait, what? Uh... <laughs> <laughs> what the heck is going on? Kane? You good? Mini golf and more. And Bro. Here we have the grounds. Drown yourself in the digital lake or engage. <laughs> what? Yo, Melon, you can have the digital lake. I'm going to go enjoy the roller coasters. All right, dude. Sounds like a deal because I'm a watermelon. Exactly. So you can't drown. Carnival. Night, day, it's all okay. The choice is yours. A cosmic buffet. Is there is of course not this is the void we wow. whoa whoa not even i know what's out there that sounds Stay terrifying where i can keep my hundreds of all seeing eyes on you yo kane is insane bro he's just spying on everyone also sunny what do you think's in the void maybe it's the secret to getting out of there that's what i was gonna say i guarantee it that in the void there's all kinds of other worlds outside of the circus and one of them's gonna have the exit <laughs> Get out of here before the moon gets frisky. Yo, chill. Wait, what's 
Oh. Ew. What did she just throw up? I think that was like cartoon ink, like another character drawing or something. Ew. 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 Bubble, that is sus. Wait, wait. Was that an exit door I saw out there? Is that a way to leave? What exit? If there was a way to leave, I'm pretty sure we'd have all left by now. <laughs> I like how chill Jax is. He just keeps messing with people casually. <laughs> and finally, this girl had enough. Bro, she messed him up. Uh, uh, I, um, I assure you, there is no magical exit door. You're probably just experiencing digital hallucinations from your mind's transition to the digital plane. I, I swear I saw Digital hallucinations! Wait, Kane is trying to hide something, Sonny. Yeah, he's pretty sus himself. It's like he doesn't want her to even try and exit. Maybe it's just because he's lonely, though. It could be, yeah. Maybe he's also a real person, but this is his fantasy world, and he wants other people to be stuck inside with him. Yo, I think you're on to something. Or the end boss has paid Kane to make sure that everyone stays at the circus. How about we talk about something else? What's like your name? My name? Uh, my name is... Uh, uh... Oh, God! Why can't I remember my name? Nobody can remember their name once they enter the digital circus. One of the few things I don't have control over are your minds. So all I can help you with is coming up with a new one. Uh... I bet you they're gonna say Pomni. I bet you they're gonna say Pomni. Yeah, sure, buddy. What if before Pomni, she's like, call me Abigail? I don't think so, Sonny. Your little head. Your new name can be anything. Yo. He just speed runs the terms of service. Congratulations. Congratulations, Kane. What are you thinking? I don't care. Just pick anything. Let's see. Whoa, random wheel of naming? See, I told you they wouldn't do Pomni first. I told you it would be X. Okay, you know what? You were kind of right. You were half right. What do you think of... I don't... You're right, terrible. Let's try that again. What do you think of Pomni? Huh? Uh, sure. I think I just... That suits you right, Jax. We should have a brand new adventure for our new member, Pomni. I like five minutes ago. You! <laughs> Do you like adventure? Activity? Wonder? Danger? Or pain? Suffering? Pain? Death? Disease? Death? Angel food cake? Ow! Yo, I want some angel food cake. That sounds yummy. It does sound delicious. Honestly, Melon, I'm starting to think we'd fit in at the digital circus. Uh, Sonny, I don't want to get trapped in there forever. Come on, bro. It'd be fun. You parasite! Uh, I don't. Since you're new around here, we're gonna make it a simple... Kane kind of seems slightly insane. To how things work around yeah, here. he what definitely do does. God, I don't want it in the house of adventure. Don't worry, Zubal. I'll make it something unobtrusive that you can still choose to not get involved with. Today's adventure is... Gather the gloinks! <laughs> Yo, he's going crazy. What is a gloink? I don't know, Sonny, but we're about to find out. <laughs> That's right. The entire circus tent will be infested with gloinks, and you gotta catch them all. But what are they? I'm glad you asked, Bubble. They're small. And what do they do? They and how do they? Gloinks are <laughs> small, mischievous critters that steal anything and everything they run into. Oh. Why don't humanoid hash browns do this? How do you stop them? That's for you to find out. Now, good luck and have fun, my little superstars. Yo, Kane is nuts. What did any of that mean? Oh, that's just um. like little adventures. They're just something fun to do to, you know, prevent us from going insane. <sighs> Speak for yourself. If anyone needs me. Oh God, oh, Yo, the gloinks just destroyed her. Wait, what the heck? I didn't know the gloinks were that strong. Oh no, they killed Zubal. Anyway, you guys want to go get something to eat? <laughs> oh wait. Wait, we what? Check on Kofmo. I'm pretty sure he'd like to meet Pomni. Bro, that was so casual. Zubal just got shredded. And Jax was like, yeah, I'm hungry. You want some lunch? And also, they're about to attack the king. I don't think they're going to attack him. I think they want to see if he wants to join them for some food. Food does sound good, Sonny. My impenetrable fortress! You want to come with us to check on Kofmo? No, not really. 
I think Kofmo's gone insane. Last time I spoke with him, he was rambling endlessly about some exit. Kind of like you, Pomni. You might be going insane too. But wait. Who is Kof now? That more likely means that exit does exist. I'm not sure. Maybe he was the other clown character that was the cardboard cutout. Yeah, you're right. We haven't seen him at all. Yeah, maybe they actually made the escape, and Pomni's gonna find the same secret exit. Could also mean you just have a jump start and losing your mind. Well, I think I'd like to ask him about it, uh, if this was real, which it isn't, because it's a dream. <laughs> she still thinks this is a dream. Uh, why are you looking at me like that? I'm fine with doing whatever, as long as I get to see funny things happen to people. <laughs> Jax is such a troll. Okay, yeah, bro. Things. You, me, and Pomni will go check on Kofmo. Which leaves Crybaby and Hoo-Ha together to go handle the Zubal situation. <laughs> do you think pairing them up together is a good idea? Of course I do. They're the two most mentally stable and capable characters. <laughs> <laughs> Yo! On, Let's go harass the clown. King was freaking. Bro, I love how there's still some glitches in this because it's a video game. True. Literally cry baby and the king the two craziest characters good luck stopping the gloinks ah, oh, Gangle, you startled me. So this is where we all live or well where we all sleep at night even though we don't really need to sleep It's sometimes nice to kind of take a break from everything and have a bit of a routine, you know I'm sure there will be one for Oh look you already got one Yo, I bet you Pomni's room is gonna be awesome. Or really creepy. What if Kane is messing with her because she's new? I bet you in her room, she's gonna have some stuff leading her to the exit. Yo, but I think it's gonna take her through that void first. Yeah, yeah. About the adventures, why even go on them at all? Why not try to find a way to leave? Well, we usually do when we first arrive, but after a while you start to realize that you really can't leave and constantly chasing an unattainable goal will start driving you a bit crazy. And eventually you get to ask him what the point of anything is and you completely lose sight of who you are oh, and why no. you're even alive. And when you reach your breaking point, something really terrible can happen. Bro, Ragatha is spiraling. Oh no, I wonder how long everyone's been here for. They're starting to all sound a little bit insane. I think they've just all lost hope because they each tried to find the exit in their own ways, but they couldn't do it. And nobody's ever gotten out of here. But you know what's kind of nice? If no one's ever gotten out, everyone can just be friends, kind of like a family even. Yeah, why don't they just accept their situation and make the best of it? Yep. Uh, but that's not something we need to deal with today. Above anything else, the adventurers give us something to do that keeps our minds healthy and stimulated. Thank goodness this is all a dream, right, Bonnie? <laughs> He's such a troll. Oh no, Pomni! Yo, <laughs> Pomni's freaking out. Again? What are we doing? We're getting one of our friends. Yo, he is not home. That other clown is not there. Huh. He probably exited, Sonny. I hope he's all right. I bet you he tried to exit, and then Kane trapped him somewhere else. Hmm, maybe you're right, Sonny. Don't worry, dollface. I've got a key to his room. Uh, wait, wha why? You, you, you shouldn't have keys to anyone's room. Nah, I've got keys everywhere, and you've all been fine. <laughs> Jax is so room, funny. So, let me know if you find it. Uh, He's such a troll. Jax! That's literally my only fear. Why would you do this? What? It could be a completely unrelated question. You'll never know until it's too late. Uh, Melon? Um, what has happened? I think this character lost his mind trying to find the exit and he's transformed into more eyeballs. Wait a second. Oh no. Is that how Kane has so many eyeballs? It's fallen characters? Yo, no. That might actually be why, Sonny. Let's find out. Thanks for keeping an eye on it, Coffee. I'm gonna head out. See ya. Oh, Coffee's been obstructed. It's okay. Uh. What? Is that? I'm scared. Uh, it might be that terrible thing I was talking about earlier when you reach your breaking point. <laughs> oh no. Right. Maybe there's still time to fix him before we get Kane. What? Oh, 
Get out of there! Always get along, like when you called me Ragatha? Over, like, laughing at your jokes. Ragatha, run! I didn't think they were funny. I was just having a bit of a bad day. <laughs> uh oh. Ragatha is getting ragged. She's getting ragged, dolled for real. Wait, Melon? She's glitching out. I didn't think that was possible. I hope she doesn't die. Oh no. Can you actually die in the digital circus? Or maybe you just glitch out and respawn somewhere else. Help me out here. I understand. You don't want to. Oh no. I'm sorry. Uh oh. Yo, get out of there, Pomney! Don't stop running. Don't even look back. Just go. Oh my goodness. Yo, where's Kane? Yeah, where is Kane when you need him? Oh, Pomney feels bad for leaving Ragatha. Oh, she's going back. Oh no, it's too late. I don't know what I'm looking at here. We saw Boink carry one of Sybil's pieces down there, remember? Oh, yeah. Thank you for the recap. What is happening? I feel like a bunch of strange things are happening in the digital circus right now. Jet! We found the Zubal hole. Cool. How is Kofmo doing? I hope he's not still mad at me for not laughing at his jokes. Oh, he's doing great. <laughs> Kofmo is not doing great. He's the opposite, bro. He's absolutely lost his mind. Bro, he's completely corrupted. But let's see what happens now. What is Jax gonna say next? Back. I don't think I've ever seen him this happy before. That is cap. Bro, Jax is such a capper. That was so much of a lie. Well, let's keep going. It's good to know he hasn't completely lost his mind. Uh, about that. <laughs> he just shoved him down the hole to find the gloinks. He's going to, though. I'd rather take on the gloinks than whatever that thing is. Yeah, the gloinks versus the corrupted monster, way better. Dude, this is the digital circus cave we've seen. Well, that's awesome. We've played hide and seek in here. Bro, the animation of this is insane. Yeah, and what is that? Insect collection? I think it's a nest. Hello? <laughs> Ragatha? That was your name, right? Yo, Ragatha is tweaking. <laughs> oh no. Hey, look. I'm I didn't mean to leave you behind like that. I just look at my hand. I I didn't know what to do. It's okay. What you need to do now is find Kane. He'll be able to fix me up and take care of Kofmo. Where is Kane? For real, though. He was there trolling Pomni from the start and then just disappeared when they needed him most. Yeah, I don't understand. Okay, but where can I find him? Bro, this is so cursed! Uh, yeah, this is weird. Okay, I'll get him. You just stay right there. Not that you can really move or anything. Uh, just hang in there. I'll be right back. I promise. Cool. Oh, so funny. I'm sorry. You're the first day here. Be so terrible. Bro, Pomni is gonna get out of here so fast. Don't worry about it. Yeah, Pomni is gonna learn quick with all these challenges. Hello? Kane? We have a bit of an issue here! Yo, where is he? Pomni's gonna explore the whole circus now. Yeah, bro, and she's all alone. She's probably so scared. Yo, what? There's an aquarium? The void. That is pretty cool. Yo, what? Ah! 
Is that from the doors? Bro, that was terrifying. Oh no. Uh oh. Uh oh. Bro, they need Kane immediately. What form of non Torturian mass dares presume presence in the nest of the Gloink Queen? <laughs> the Gloinks. Oh, you, you know, you could have asked for my consent before forcing me to see something so completely and utterly disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, Jax just roasted him. A rabbitoid that runs its mouth in the presence of my royal figure. Well, you myself, I would like I love King. Hi, Zubal. Ah, help me, you idiot! Kinda rude, Zubal. Now I don't wanna help you. That's true. If I was gonna help someone and then they were being rude and angry towards me, I'd probably just walk away. Yeah, I'd let them die. Oh, I always lose. Yeah! <laughs> Cause she can only play paper. True. Wait, what? Oh. What? King, are you mother Did he just lose his hands? Yeah, I'll be fine. Dude, he just got robbed. Oh no, everything's glitching out here too. Oh no, Melon. She is gonna jump down the hole to hide and bring the monster in with her. You think so? Or do you think she's gonna have to go into the void? Bruh, I'm pretty sure she's gonna jump down that hole and then glitch out the giant queen ant of the Gloinks. We're about to find out. Or she's gonna get hypnotized. She's seeing herself for the first time. And she's like, dang, I'm kind of pretty. No, she's like, uh, I don't understand what is happening. Yo, wait, what? She's got monkeys in a barrel to help her? Yo, that was actually so clutch. Yeah, those are a great distraction. Yo, he's like a little dog. God, a big King? dog. Exit. Yo, go! No, but you can't leave everybody here behind like that. Uh, yeah, you can. I would totally dip. Palmney, you fell for the trap. It's not a real exit. Oh, no. Yeah, she's not back in her normal body. This was a test of your humanity, and you failed. Wow. Do you think she's in the back rooms? I don't know. This digital circus is gigantic. Oh no. Yo, chill. You foolish assortment of colorful characters. Do you not realize that everything must be Gloinks? I am Gloinks. <laughs> what is this? Bruh. Hey, Melon, do you want to become a Gloink? Uh, I don't know, bro. This guy is crazy. And honestly, Kane needs to deal with them. They should not be allowed to create this many Gloinks to terrorize the circus. This is dumb and weird. Well, you're still watching it. I'm not here for the adventure <laughs> or anything. <laughs> what? I told you this would happen. Oh, thank God you're okay. You didn't experience a game show in there, did you? Uh, I... What are you talking about? <laughs> he probably got eaten there before, too. Yeah, exactly. What's happening? Yo, this guy is glitching everything. I have a bad feeling a glitched out queen of the gloinks is gonna be real bad news. Yeah, I don't know about this. Over there. <laughs> they have an escalator. Yeah, let's First. just peacefully and slowly take the escalator. Yo, Jax is kind of mean. Yeah, that was uncalled for. Wait, Pummy's not even here? Wasn't this whole thing for her? Be quiet. I can't hear the escalator. Uh, what? <laughs> okay, where is the back room's gonna take her? I don't think it's gonna be the real exit, I'll say that much. Maybe she'll find Kane. He's in like the head office, the CEO. 
Yeah, you're right. She's probably going to run into Kane. And I think someone's sending these doors to try and help her get out. Maybe. Or are they just trying to trick her? Bro, where is she? She's deep in the back room, sonny. For real, though. Oh, no. Don't go on that computer. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Melon, we got to remember those letters. C and A. Don't know what it stands for, but it's probably important. It's probably the company that created the digital circus. Oh, no. This hallway seems like it's giving her the heebie-jeebies. Yeah, this is creepy. The void! Yo, she's in the void. Oh, that's bad. Bro, this is like Star Wars. She's going light speeds. What is happening? Where is she gonna go? In a galaxy far, far away, Pomni shall find her former human body. Or just go completely insane. <laughs> Dude, Kane better do something about this. I know how to make me say this exact sentence. Yes! Alert on my wacky watch. Wait, what? Oh no. Oh no! Someone's venturing out into the void! They'll get totally spoiled! They'll get spoiled? Wait, what will get spoiled? Wait, yeah, what? Hold on. Let's rewind. Let's hear that again. Yes! Alert on my wacky watch at this hour? Oh no! Someone's venturing out into the void! They'll get totally spoiled! Yeah, that is what he said. Spoiled? What does that even mean? I don't know, Sonny. There you go! Uh, what did she see? I don't know. Do you think it's like a good spoiled, like they're gonna be a rich, bratty kid? Or like they're gonna go bad, like spoiled food? I think it's the second one, Sonny. Oh no. Pomni has seen too much. Her brain has been spoiled! What the heck happened around here? Oh yeah, my doing. Kane! Kopmo went through a sort of kopmosis and abstracted. Kopmo abstracted? Why didn't anybody tell me? Everyone was trying to. Bruh. And into the cellar you go. Yo. Oh my god. Man, I can't believe Kopmo just gave up like that. I mean, no offense, Kinger, but I always thought you would be next. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> So Alright, fix Ragatha, come on. Dude, Kane is in Yeah, he just got rid of that glitch like it was nothing. I do have to apologize for lying about the exit. I knew how much all of you have been wanting there to be one, but you know, I was having so much trouble figuring out what to put on the other side and ended up never quite finishing it. And you know how I never like letting people see my unfinished work, especially if it leads you out into the void. Yikes. Anyway, looks like you defeated the Gloik Queen, so I guess the adventure's over. Your reward is a delicious digital feast cooked by our head bubble chef. Made with all the love I'm legally allowed to You know, I am pretty hungry. You didn't even do anything. <laughs> I can still be hungry. Well, not really, because we don't need to eat, drink, or sleep. And oh, that food do look good, though. Yeah. At least chow down. Really it look be, it, it look bussin'. Come on, eat that, eat that. Oh no. <laughs> Pommy oh, no. is sad. Pommy this is might be going good, insane. Aww. I'm sad now. Yo. Whoa. What's gonna happen, Sonny? Bro, What's outside here. the void? It's just a computer. Wait, that's the same computer what? that Pomni saw. What? Bro, the amazing digital circus was so good. I can't wait for more episodes. Yo, 
know, this is Rainbow Friends, but it's the end of Blue's story. Today, we might say goodbye to the Blue Rainbow Friend. I hope not. And later in this video, we check out the biggest battle ever between the Rainbow Friends versus Huggy Wuggy and Poppy Playtime. This was crazy. Let's get 500 likes for more epic videos. And if you're new here, subscribe right now to get goaded. Ellen, we're about to watch a video called Goodbye Blue. It might be the last time we see him in Rainbow Friends. No, Blue's like the most classic character. I can't go on without him. Too late. I'm in play. I, I think this is as far as I go. Blue friend, what's going on? I, uh, Please, Blue, say something. I need you. I don't want to be alone. Please. Rin, my friend, I'm wounded. I think this is my end. I want to say that you were always my best friend. No matter what, no matter where I am, you will always be in my heart. I love you, Green. <laughs> oh. Yo, Melon, this is so sad. No way. I didn't want to watch that, bro. That actually brought a tear to my eye. <laughs> the thing is, bro, at least he had green to keep him company at the very end. Yeah, he had a good friend. The thing is, Melon, if I was green, I would have just slapped that melon off your head and kept moving with my day. Bro, what is wrong with you? That's not cool. Bro, I'm a monster like that. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, you see purple just walk away. He's like, nah, I'm out. It just save him. <laughs> oh, it's okay, buddy. Come on, come on. He's gonna be okay, right? Green, I'm sorry, buddy. He would have liked you to have it. What do you mean? Yo, that is so sad. Blue's crown is now green's. Dude, no. I don't like this, honey. This is not good. Whoa. Flashbacks. Wait, what? Green was a blind dude? No way. That makes sense. That's why you can't see he's in the game. I know. And then the Rainbow Friends factory changed them all into giant toys. There's Blue saving him. They were best friends. Dude, this is making me sad. Oh no, then they went to Odd World Melon. And they got shot by the toy making machine. And transformed into green and blue, the originals. Yo, this is crazy. Look at their friendship, bro. They're best friends. It's like you and me. Yeah. Wait, who's this little guy? Yo. Oh my, dude, what just happened? Green just ate a Roblox noob. Yo, all the rainbow friends are comforting green. I think red's gonna have a good idea though. Pink? Hey, what's wrong? Answer me. Come on, Pink. We still have so many things to do together. Red, oh, please. You gotta help her! You gotta be kidding me, Melon. First it's blue, now we're hearing about pink? This is so sad! What is going on? I didn't think Rainbow Friends would be this emotional. What? I... I'll see what I can do. He's trying to save pink! Us? Oh no. What? No! Pink! Oh no! <laughs> Wait, that was Red's hand. Why is he even trying to help them? He's the one who turned them into these Rainbow Friend monsters. Because they're happier as monsters, Sonny. You don't get it, okay? You're stupid. Okay, I'm sorry. There's so many emotions right now. I don't know what to think. Wait, they were kids in the factory once too. Yo, and they were completing the tasks, just like us in chapter one.
They were in love, bruh. This is so cute. Oh my goodness, then they got put in the cloning machine. Yo, red is crazy. Melon, never mess with red rainbow friend. Unless you want to transform and eat small children noobs. No, oh, why do they... It's so cute, and then they literally murder kids. <laughs> no, the kid's getting away, bro. The kid's making a getaway. Oh, wait. That's how he lost his eye. Yo, what? This is crazy. We're learning so much about the lore. No, not pink. She's a ghost. Actually, she's an angel. I can't tell if this is sad or happy now. Okay, it's sad. I'll never forget you. Look at his ugly face. I hate blue. Whoa, what the heck? And what a transition, Melon. That went from being so emotional to straight up Huggy Wuggy being angry at all the rainbow friends. He thinks he's better than me? We'll see. Huh. Uh, 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 what did you just say? Huh. You're gonna pay Yo, they're about to fight. They're gonna fight. Who do you think's gonna win? Huh. I got my money on Blue and the Rainbow Friends, bro. They're way more goaded than Huggy Wuggy. We'll see. We'll see what Huggy Wuggy does. Yo, he brought in backup. He's got the FNAF and Poppy Playtime crew. Dude, they are angry. They're having a wrap off. Yo, pink versus pink. Purple just is like, leave me out of this. I want to go in my bed. <laughs> what? He's got more confidence. Oh, snap. Bring it on, bro. Bring it on. It's about to get serious, Melon. Very, very serious. Uh -oh. Power up. Eat the kids. Wait, no, wait. The kids are eating blue. What is What's going, going on? on? Dude. Dude. He lost his eyeball again? I feel so bad for him. Oh, he's charging up. He's getting more powerful. Huggy Wuggy is too, though. Yo, Huggy Wuggy's going crazy mode. Frankenstein style. What? You're only a booklet version of us. We'll finish you. Yeah. You guys can all get along. You're all awesome. Oh, wait. She's hitting the big punch. So is green. Yo, what is Bonzo Bunny doing? Yo, Orange is going to eat the bunny. Go, Orange. Go, Orange. Oh, wait. They're going to eat the kid together. <laughs> That's so cute. Maybe they realize they can truce and just destroy all the kids when they go on field trips. D for dad. D for dad? Because he's going to get eaten alive, bro. Oh, they're seeing who can get more kids. I see. They're teaming up, I think. Yo, Huggy Wuggy looks scary. Bruh. Oh, my. out of the vents. He's going crazy. Melon, this is what happens when Purple leaves the vents. Purple's ready to scrap. He's gonna take pink. He's gonna squeeze her until she's nothing but juice. Dude, I don't... She's not a watermelon, bro. 
Sorry, I just think everything can get juiced into a smoothie. <laughs> no, it's not how that works. Sorry, it's just your melon top, bro. I'm gonna slap it off and make a smoothie dough. Stop! Wait, they realized Red's the real villain. Take out Red. I don't know what's happening. Why is Blue defending Red? And Kissy Missy just wants everyone to stop fighting. She's right. Bruh, it's getting crazier. The song is getting faster. Who's gonna win? Melon, what do you think's gonna happen? What do you think's gonna happen? I think Blue gets the Wombo Combo. He's so much stronger. Look how big he is. All I know is they look angrier than you in the morning. I do get grumpy. Peace. Peace. <laughs> oh, let's go. Prepare to lose, Huggy. Wait, like to what? Lose your I'm not afraid. You Wait, why are they fighting again? Bro, they just had peace, and now they're going to battle in an epic rap battle. Yo. Let's go. Hey, Blue got the heat, though. Whoa, I actually hug you, hug you, bring in the real heat. He said, ooh, ah, yo, ah, yo. Hey, yo, what? He's drawing a goofy face on him. Yo, clean that up. Good move, good move. Evil. Yo, I think Blue is more evil than Huggy Wuggy, to be honest. I think so. Oh. Ah! Now they're saving kids together. Are they really? Or is Huggy Wuggy just keeping them for himself? And then he's gonna make a giant baby kid stew. He's gonna make a big soup out of them. Fighting. <laughs> Now's my turn. Rawr! Yo, green. Bro, this is a jam. I'm loving it. Yo, green's sad now. Yo, Melon, which is your favorite character? I like blue. Blue is cool. Blue is for noobs. Blue is really cool. I think the best character is... Kissy Missy because she wanted them to all be friends. That's so boring, Sonny. What? So boring. Imagine if all of them could be friends. Think about how much destruction they could cause and how many cookies they could make. Oh, that's a lot of cookies. That's true. That could be a lot of good cookies. Yo, what is going on? Are they going to burn the factory to the ground? This is dangerous, guys. Wait, Orange, he's the hungriest rainbow friend. Melon? Melon? The music's getting fast again. Dude, it's getting crazy. Yo, Orange is going speedy mode. He's on a sugar rush. He had too many cookies. Yo, five second rule. Five second rule. Just eat it. Just eat it. Ooh, cake? I need some of that. My dude is going fast. Melon, this is so chaotic. Oh, he ate the whole cake in one bite. Yo, his belly is bursting. Hey, Blue. You okay, friend? Boyfriend, run! Not Blue, it's a corrupted imposter. Blue, why are you locked? Uh oh. Oh no, Melon, it's a second blue who's the imposter. The real blue's trying to warn this kid. Yo, what the heck? Let's see what happens next. Come on, blue, get out of jail. You gotta save your friend. Through the power of epic music. Wait, what? That robot blue was green? Yo, he just transformed, bro. Oh no, he's gonna eat the kid. 
blue and the real green saved him. No, he transformed again. How does he keep doing this? He's orange now. He's the imposter. But who do you think he really is? It's probably red. It's probably red. Come on, purple. Save the day. Oh boy, that was close. What? This is impossible. Oh, where's my friend? Right here. Aww. <laughs> I'm glad you're safe. We all are. <laughs> this place gives me the heebie-jeebies. Uh huh? No way. Is that blue? What is he doing there? Yo, they put blue in a clone Ooh, machine. What is this? Guess we'll find out. <laughs> He's gonna swap What's with blue. To me? I feel kind of weird. Oh no! I'm turning into blue. Oh no! The imposter, Melon. Yo! Oh, did the imposter feel his body? What is going on? Get in the vents, quick! Yo, that purple looks sus. Run, what dude! Is this bottom for? Swap your body back! Swap your body back! Whoa! View! That's an old Yo, Whoa. that was insane! That was crazy, bro. What an emotional roller coaster. If you guys want to see more Rainbow Friends animations, make sure you like and subscribe. And click the next video on screen. Click it right now.